Welcome back, Multifamily Geeks. This is Max Rock with MultifamilyGeeks.com with another multifamily underwriting tip. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. It's always greatly appreciated. And don't forget to click the bell to be notified when new tips come out. Thanks again, geeks. And now for the tip. So now we're ready to go ahead and code columns. And if you don't know what to do next, just keep clicking the instructions tab. It'll tell you the third step here, link to drop downs. Come on in and let's start to identify these columns here. We wanna know the unit type. So you can hold down your shift button and use the scroll wheel on your mouse to go back and forth. See how quickly I can do that? Back and forth, back and forth. So here's the unit type over here, A. So I'm gonna come over here, type A, enter. It's gonna fill in that column with all the unit types, right? Actually, that's unit. Now I'm gonna do unit type right here, a column B. Sorry about that. So B, enter. Fills it in. Tenant. Here's all the tenant names. Column E. So let's fill that in. There we go. And we're going to keep filling these in. And I'm going to show you the next step. And you're not going to believe how we can take this entire 308 unit rent roll and turn it into a very respectable and easy to use and even paste it directly into the underwriting template. So don't forget to go to multifamilygeeks.com. Log into a free account on Anthro Bank. Go to the Tools tab and download our latest version of this free multifamily underwriting template. Thanks for listening and keep living love, grow, freedom.